everyone can communicate through dance and movement and you can bond through dance and mu movement. It's really cool because your personality kind of automatically incorporates itself into your movement. But there are people who are very, very intense, so their movements are very sharp and very strong, and, and people who are even, who are really, really timid, and they're, they're very careful and precise with their movements. Movement never lies, as Martha Graham says. I don't think anybody looks stupid when they dance, because everybody's movement style is so cool, because it's just so them. And that's so cool, and all movement is beautiful movement to me. I mean, especially in dance. In the dance world, you have to not be afraid to make a fool out of yourself. Like, you're gonna fall, you're gonna look dumb sometimes, so it's just something you gotta push through. One of the awesome things about dance is that it develops your mind in such a way that it'll help you in so many areas. Yeah, there are people who become dance professors, dance historians, dance therapists, performers, choreographers, who have had a comfortable life and made it like pretty successful, but it's also the fact that the skills you learn here, it doesn't mean you're stuck with dance forever or that if you're in a situation where you can't support yourself with dance that you can't do something else. I'm like so lucky that I get to do this every day, so.